Okay, I'm Alex Singh, and um, I first came for an interview here in uh, September 1978, and met Arthur Gamble and Lionel Bishop, and I was dressed in a three-piece suit, and it was quite hot, and I, there I was. And I came in, and they told me, no, you don't have to wear any uniforms. Coming from Jamaica, this was God blessed for me. I mean, I was really happy because I didn't like uniforms. So um, uh, I started straight away in Form 9. Uh, my tutor was uh, Owen Gray, and we still keep very much in touch. In fact, um, la I think earlier this year, we had uh, dinner with him uh, and quite a few of the other teachers who taught me during that period. Uh, um, uh, chemistry, English, like Ken Woolard, and so on. So one of the first things uh, that struck me, I mean, coming here, was the fact that you call teachers by their first names. I mean, it was something which was unheard of. And, uh, well, uh, one of my very good teachers, Ken Woolard, for example, taught English literature. And, uh, yes, that uh, he gave me a love for English literature, which I then went on to do A-levels uh, in English literature. We had also uh, excellent history teacher, geography teachers, um, Kathleen Rawls. Uh, in fact, I uh, just called her last year. She was uh, almost 80 or in her 80s. She was in Edinburgh um, on the day of the Scottish uh, um, um, elections. And uh, anyway, she was um, very much uh, uh, in good health and very g happy to hear me because, well, we went to Swanage and so on on different field trips and all of that was, was fantastic. Um, we had an excellent uh, history teacher, Christine Waitman, and um, she gave us this love for history as well. And all of that, you know, helped to go on to do things like A-level history and, and so on. And Kathleen Rose also taught uh, A-level economics. In fact, I was one of the students who I wanted to go on and read economics at university. So um, I asked for economics to be introduced. And in fact, it was introduced that year. And Kathleen Rose was the person who taught us. So thanks to all the wonderful teachers um, that have helped through this uh, period. And uh, thanks to them, I am where I am today. So that's the part where it goes with regard to the teachers and the institution. Of course, we made some very wonderful friends. Um, from the first day I came in, I had uh, people who were taking me around, um, trying, holding my hands, uh, not literally, but uh, <laughs> figuratively. And uh, I'm very much in touch with uh, a lot of these people today. And in fact, even we try to organize uh, uh, on a regular basis um, reunions, um, whether, well, largely informal, but maybe five, ten of us in different parts of the world, London, Brussels, you name Amsterdam. And uh, in fact, I was quite privileged to be uh, invited by four of the uh, girls from my year last year, and we went to Sri Lanka, and so there were five of us all celebrating 50 or 51 years, and um, so we're very much a tight bunch, and um, so I think that was something that the British school uh, gave us. It's uh, this sense of unity, so no matter where you came from, we are still very much close if you make the efforts to stay in touch, and I must say, Thumbs up to Facebook because it has helped a lot of us to be back in touch.